Hi there, my name is Ari Media Adem and welcome back to Data Channel. On today on Data, we're going to be doing an unboxing review video of a home theater system. Um, I got this home theater system off Jumia a few weeks ago. Um, it's an LG HT 358SD home theater system which comes, which comes with a 5.1 fully functional surround system. And so we're going to be doing an unboxing video looking at the pros, the cons, the features, the bells and whistles and whatnot in this home theater system. So come along with me and let's do this unboxing. So it came in well wrapped, well in so many layers of, of nylon and I had quite a time getting off all the layers off and so when you get all the layers off, you get a box, a carton, in which, which, which houses the uh, home theater system. So in front it says experience the real surround sound. And then that's 300 watts. It shows the power rating 300 watts in front. And by the side it shows um, the some more details. The model, two year warranty. And then, okay, so just let's get to opening up what's in this home theater system. On opening the box, you are welcomed by five identical speakers, which form part of the 5.1 surround system. They are identical and they have wires attached to their backs, which are not detachable. And that pretty much forms the first layer. So in the second layer, we have the woofer system, which is well sized, not too heavy, well designed, with good materials. It has a chrome lining in front for the speaker and also has an LG sign in front. At the back, it has the diaphragm and the connecting wire, which is also non-detachable. And so that forms the second layer and the third layer we have the controller system and um, which is pretty much very basic it has basic functions and so it has uh, the different buttons for controlling diff different things and then we have the usb port we also have the volume rocker which is well sized big enough feels well with handling we have this dvd tray too um, for playing everything related to dvd and cd so at the back we have different ports for different purposes and uh, we also have a series of warnings and all that at the back and um, so the ports are basically for sound depending on what kind of sound you want to do but then you only need the auxiliary sound those are the ones that are that have a black background those two one, those two ports that have a black background those are what the ones you use for auxiliary input and then we have the ports for the speakers for the six speakers yes so that's where you connect them to and like i said you have the ports different ports for sound but then you just need those ones with the back, black background for your auxiliary basically and uh, that's pretty much it for the back of the controller then we also have the power cable which is a uh, um, three-pronged uh, uh, power cable which um, which is good um, so that pretty much makes up all the layers and then we have this nylon here which contains the uh, manual um, connecting cable the speaker and the remote control and so the remote control is well sized not heavy light cheap material plastic and um, it has uh, most of all the control you need and all that nothing so too much special about it and then we have the manual the manual is actually impressive it has the, the, it's it's well explanatory and it's all you need actually to set up the sound system the english is easy to understand and easy to follow through 
I like some other sound systems. Anyway, it's LG anyway, so I don't expect ex expect anything less. And so that's that for the manual. And then we have the connecting cables. We have the antenna, which you can connect to the back of the controller if you're using the FM radio. And so the antenna, it, it, the the other end of the uh, of the connecting cable for the antenna has is shaped such in such a way that you can hang it so, yeah, anywhere and um, you can get your reception for your fm radio and um, we have the connecting cable the connecting cable you can use to connect to any sound source or your television um, usually and so this will give you the surround system that you desire um, while watching that movie that you want to enjoy so that's pretty much about what comes in the box and so we're gonna go into looking at each of the components now so setting up the system is not hard at all it's pretty much straightforward so when you get all the speakers out and ready to set up you basically just connect all the wires to the back of the speakers after choosing the position that you want to set them up in um, for the purpose of this unboxing review i won't be positioning the speakers in the ideal position so if you're going to be put positioning the speakers you should use the 5.1 um, system of arranging the speakers which will give you that immersive surround effect so basically you put you put the center speaker in front of you you put the right and left speaker 60 degrees to your right and your left then you put the right and the left surround speaker at about 100 degrees to 110 degrees to your right and left respectively and so basically you have yeah you can you you and basically you have the setup all done you can put the woofer anywhere but preferably you can put it in front of you just to have a more centralized effect and so with that you're good to go so once you have the 5.1 setup you find but for this video i'm just going to arrange everything in front and not use the 5.1 setup and so it's pretty much simple to set up like i said you just connect the different parts the different speakers to their respective places now the um now the set of five speakers that we have in this sound system are not um specific to any of the channels you so you can connect them to either the rear right or rear left or right or left or whichever one so just connect them to the uh, respective channels and then you will be fine so the subwoofer here this is the subwoofer and so we're getting the nylon off the subwoofer yeah and so this is the subwoofer so it comes in piano black yeah it's piano black it looks good to look upon and you can see the sound diffuser just down there Pretty much all the parts of the sound system are actually in piano black. Every other thing is in cheap plastic. The other parts of the body is in cheap plastic, but the front of the system, the grills and all that are in piano black. And so that's that for the um, sound system basically. So when you have it all set up, then you get your system on you put it on so when you put it on what welcomes you is by default the disc um player so that's the default when you put on the sound system so it comes default to the disc player then you can press the function key and then it changes to the radio tuner and then we press the function key again and then it changes to the bluetooth um function and so that's basically it so we also have below it we have the usb system if you connect your usb it imme immediately detects it and then you can just plug and play 
um that's basically it and so and so let's see how it sounds now So I tested all the surround features of this sound system and it came out or it came out very well. All the speakers, the proper separation for sound for surround 5.1 to the various components of the surround speakers works perfectly well and it gives a very rich sound. So this sound system is a go. It's very 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 it's a good bargain for the money and i think i got this at about between 35 and 38 thousand naira on jumia and so i'll leave a link below in the description um to where you can purchase this on jumia uh, i'm not sure if this particular product is still available but there is a similar product that is online which you can get which has the same configurations as this and will just do fine as this speaker and so that's basically it for this unboxing video and um, see you next time on this um, with another video